All right, guys, we're doing a 2018 Topps Definitive Baseball case. This is Random Players number 10. Thank you, everybody, for watching and joining. Uh, there are 171 different players plus a spot in the break for any cut signatures that we pull. So 172 spots in the break. Um, there was one oversell. I believe it was um, it was S. Murphy 025 that, was, that oversold the break by one spot. We had already issued you fire hand points. See how many times you're going to randomize your list of participants and players. Good luck. Just two times. Two times on draw. Um, that break should be in the uh, that break should be in the store right now, Paul. I'll shoot you a direct link in just a moment, okay? Assuming it's still there. Last I checked, there's still 11 spots. All right. Starting with our participants in the break, we have Thunder Cards at the top, and we have Rob H Town at the bottom. We're going to randomize this list twice. Good luck. One. Second and final time, two. All right, JB15385 in the number one spot, and Mora86 in the 172 spot. All right, guys, and on to your players. Aaron Judge at the top, Zach Granite. At the bottom, followed by the any cut signature spot right there. Two times on draw. Best of luck. One. Second and final time. Two. It's Euro in the number one spot. Victor Robles in the 172 spot. All right. Let me sort you guys by... User. There we go. So we got Adam Bug 924 to Ryan Burkett. And Ryan Burkett's going to have some more after spot 36 here. All right. Let's see some of the highlights here as far as players are concerned. Bryce Harper going to Andrew FN. Mariano Rivera, BGP 100. All right, give me a second here, guys. On the left side of your screen, I'm just going to I have to um, look and see. Yeah, there's a spot right here, Paul. Gloves, cuts, and a ball. Random letters number six. So let me, I'll go ahead and copy in that link for you here. All right, Paul, there's a link for you right there. I'll put it back there. Okay. From, uh, let's see, 37 to 72. So more of Ryan Burkett down to DJ Cherney. And that's the last of the DJ Cherney. So all, D all, all of DJ Cherney's is all right here. All right. Let's see what we got going on here as far as some highlights. Hey, Z, how you doing, man? Chi Town 101, your one hitter quitter is going to be Albert Pujols. Best of luck, man. DJ Cherney is Cal Ripken Jr., Mark McGuire. Yeah, no doubt, man. I hope you're doing well. USA beat the world ten to six. All right, so from 73 to 108. So Dylan J12 to JB15385, and that's JB15385's first of many names. Let's see. Look at some highlights here. Frank has Hank Aaron. Gear M6 is Derek Jeter. 
Grandma G, one spot quitter. Aaron Nola, good luck to you, man. Bogarts, Pudge, and Larkin for my boy I've been Ryan. Good Chiro's going to JB15385, and he's got some more after this. <laughs> now he's ready. <laughs> James 81, one hitters, Brandon Crawford. Good luck. Okay. All right, guys. Uh, from 109 to 144. So more of JB15385 to 144. R.A. Tully. One of many for R.A. Tully. <clears throat> JCF 1083, two spots. JCF 1083, two spots. Judge and Strawberry. Very New York frame of mind. Good luck to you, JCF. What else we got? What else do we have? M. Dennis, 14. Trying for the case hit with one spot. Frank Thomas. Prickle, 125. Sandy Koufax, one out of his two spots. Good luck to everybody, of course. Pugles has Tom Seaver for his one spot. Natty 12B has Greg Maddox for his one spot. Mm, excuse me. Uh, M. Dennis is on. I think he was on the breakers feed earlier, but he may not be on right now. M. Dennis 14 has a one hitter in Frank Thomas. Adam Phillips, Chi Town 101, has a one hitter in Albert Fulholz. All right. And from 145 to 172. So, R.A. Tolley through Thunder Cards. Oh, M. Dennis is on the group. All right. They know you're on the YouTube chat, Mike. Thanks for coming on and hanging out for a bit. Uh, Susie Papa to one spot. Any cut signatures? Cut signature pulls up. That would be that would be a big win right there. <laughs> SMD has Mike Trout for one of their two spots. Sato Ken, Byron Buxton. Always try and trade for your socks. That's all that's perfectly understandable. Hey, you never know. Sometimes you got a perfect you got a perfect storm. You know how it is. Sean with his one spot's got Andrew Benatendi. All right. All right, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get all your names on the screen here. I gotta resort them by uh, resort them by player name here. Now I'm going to get you guys all on the screen. All right. Uh, hey, Mark, uh, uh, I don't know if Chow will be posting a mega filler later, but we really haven't had too much in the way of filler so far that we would need to do to fill a break. Um, if Inception, if one of the Inception breaks get a little closer, I could probably do one of those. All right. There's all your names on the side of your, on left side of your screen there. Of course, uh, as we pull, I can always scroll down. Every break that we get will highlight in red. Of course, any dual, of course, any dual uh, player cards that are owned by multiple people will be random off, for the most part, unless there's something extremely valuable, in which case I'll probably email you guys after the break and see if you guys want to work something out. 
All right, best of luck, guys. Let's do these. Oh, to send a link on YouTube. Uh, what I could do is, um, uh, what I could do is uh, usually what Chad does is that sometimes I think what he'll do sometimes is he'll do separate videos for the um, he'll do separate videos for the for the draw and then for the break itself. Um, in my case, what we'll do is um, uh, the same video will have both the draw and the break. And then what I can do, Ryan, is I uh, what I did the last time I did a random players actually is I'll copy and paste the uh, the list into an email and shoot the and shoot the email and shoot the email out to you uh, out to you guys with with the list. So I can do that after the break as well, so you guys have it for reference. All right, guys. Good luck. Um, you know, I think I could do something like that. I can at least I can at least shoot the email. So if I did this and and if I copied you guys, let me just do this real quick. And if I copied all your emails here again, oh shoot, you know I just deleted it. Dang it. All right. Hey, Ryan, I'll do this. I'll go ahead and shoot you the email right away, and then I'll shoot everybody else the email after the break. That way, at least I have it. All right, I just shot you an email right now. You're a BCC on email. I just uh, sent over to you. All right, and then I'll see how Chad. I'll see exactly how Chad does it, so I can mimic that as much as possible. And we'll we'll go from there. I think the last time what I did was I uh, after the break I emailed you guys the full list so you guys had it for reference if you wanted to watch it back. All right, guys. All right, box number one. Good luck. Uh, for the Boston Red Sox, number 28 out of 30. That's a patch of Craig Kimbrell. And Craig Kimbrell belongs to... There he is. LTMB 718 with Craig Kimbrell. All right, next up, we got a green bordered patch, numbered 8 out of 15 for the Kansas City Royals, Eric Hosmer. Uh, Eric Hosmer goes to G Shock, 808. All right, uh, next up. Uh, number 33 of 35, Reese Hoskins for the Philadelphia Phillies autograph. Your best friend, Reese Hoskins, is going to Ryan Burkett. All right, next up, we got a rookie autograph, number 50 of 50 for the Baltimore Orioles, Chance Sisko. All right, let's see. Chance Cisco is going to go to Gear M6. All right, next up we got a gold framed autograph, number 19 out of 30 for the New York Yankees, Andy Pettit. Let's go on, Scott. How you doing, man? Andy Pettit, DJ Cherney. All right. Uh, next up, we got a purple bordered jersey autograph. 
Number 7 out of 10, Miguel Sano, or as we like to call it, the uh, the big old white napkin right there. Uh, Miguel Sano, number 7 out of 10. Uh, Miguel Sano is going to go to... Uh-oh, do I have any... Nope. Okay. Napo Fan 25. Uh-oh. Uh, what the heck? Sorry, guys. Give me a second. I'm not sure if our feed's out. Are you guys seeing me okay? Because I'm getting, I'm getting a report that I'm getting uh, some drop frames here, both on, uh, both on uh, Breakers and on YouTube. All right, so, all right, so you're seeing me okay, Ryan? All right, I'm not so sure about the uh, breakers. Sorry, give me a second. It does keep freezing. All right, guys, give me just a moment. Okay, yeah, a little spotty, maybe 30 seconds. Because right, right now it's showing. Uh, okay, so it looks like it looks like it's okay now. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah, because I saw that I'm going. Uh oh. You know, I just want to make sure that we weren't completely uh, we weren't completely kaput, and that I'm going through a break, and then you guys are able to see it. All right. So it looks like we're in good shape now. All right. Obviously, of course, we do a recap and every. Excuse me. At the end of every break, so if we missed it, if you missed anything, rest assured you'll be able to see everything. All right, for the Baltimore Orioles, Cal Ripken Jr. That is a green bordered jersey autograph. Uh, is it doing it again? Ah, oh, crap. Uh, Cal Ripken Jr. is going to go to DJ Cherney. Uh, sorry guys all right um what i'm gonna do is i'm going uh now you got now you're saying it's fine i'm still showing drop frames which is uh which is a um kind of weird i want to look at something else here sorry guys i'm i don't know what it is but i'm seeing drop frames and i'm kind i'm concerned All right, you're fine. Okay. All right, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep that feed up at the same time. All right, I'm gonna keep going here. Uh, we got a dual autographed relic collection. This is a red parallel. That means this is a Uno de Uno, one of one. Anthony Rizzo and Kyle Schwarber for the Chicago Cubs. All right, Anthony Rizzo, SMD. Kyle Schwarber is Dennis seventy five. Um, I'm, in, I'm instead of putting this to random at the end of the break. This is the red parallel. It's the one of one. So I will um, I will go ahead and give you guys an email and uh, see if you guys want to work a deal out between yourselves. If you guys want to sell and split the card, we can accommodate that for you as well. <laughs> My feet isn't showing good cards for me. I like that. All right, last card of box one is for the New York Mets. Green bordered rookie auto, 15 out of 25, Ahmed Rosario. Uh, Ahmed Rosario belongs to Dennis 75. Yeah, I'm kind of looking at my feed right now on a separate. Yeah, now I'm seeing that I'm getting uh, that's slowing down for me a little bit too. So, like, I'm looking at the feed as as uh, you see it on YouTube. Like, I'm looking at the same feed right now. So, I'm seeing that it's occasionally glitching as well. 
All right, so that's where the drop frames are coming from. All right, just as long as I haven't been completely cut off and you guys aren't seeing anything, that's my biggest concern. Although, obviously, any time that there's any drop frames, I'm concerned. All right, so I'm going to put this aside. All right, box number two. This is a weird pack that only had one piece of um, padding there. All right. Uh, right away for the LA Dodgers, we've got a game used batting helmet. Jock Peterson, number five out of seven. That's a purple border version. Uh, Jock Peterson. Yeah, now it's starting to slow down again on my feed. Yeah, I know. I might need a reboot, huh? Oh, there it goes. Yeah, it's just running slow. All right, Jock Peterson going to Shoebot. Is it a California rolling blackout? Uh, I haven't heard that there's been any blackouts scheduled. <laughs> we haven't had one of those in a long time as far as like a scheduled blackout. All right. Uh, next up for the Pittsburgh Pirates, number 24 out of 25, Josh Harrison. This is a patch. Uh, Josh Harrison, the Pittsburgh Pirates, and that's going to go J Frey 77. <laughs> it's all good, man. I like a good rolling blackout joke. <laughs> I'm just kind of going a little bit slow right now, only because I'm kind of trying to pay attention to my feed that I'm the way that you guys are seeing it, just to make sure it's not all too sh all too shabby. All right, next up we got an inscription autograph. The inscription autographs for the Toronto Blue Jays. Robbie Alomar, twenty one to twenty five. And Roberto Alomar belongs to Frank. Frank has got Roberto Alomar. All right. And we're going to follow that up with Anthony Banda for the Arizona Diamondbacks, number 22 out of 50. Rookie autograph. Uh, Anthony Banda belongs to... Shubat. Uh oh. Live stream is offline. Shoot. Right. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, YouTube, uh, are you guys, uh, I, I see that we're back on, I see we're back live. Are you guys seeing me okay? Okay. So, I, all right. I stopped, I stopped right away just to let you guys know the last, um, the last two autographs that were hit were the Roberto Alomar, which I think was right around the time that we lost uh, lost the uh, feed. Roberto Alomar for the Blue Jays. And then the last one we just pulled was Anthony Banda, number 22 out of 50. And that's going to Shubat. Okay. All right. And I'm seeing that we're live too. All right. All right, guys. Next up, we got a purple bordered rookie autograph, number eight out of ten for the Phillies, JP Crawford. JP Crawford for the Phillies. Uh, JP Crawford belongs to Shubot. I think Shubot's just hit three in a row here. All right, pretty cool piece right there. Uh, next up, we got a dual autograph for the Oakland A's, number two out of 35. 
Dennis Eckersley and Raleigh Fingers. Two out of 35. So let's see. Uh, Dennis Eckersley belongs to Bernie DeRoach. Raleigh Fingers belongs to Gear M6. So I'm going to put this one to a random draw at the end of the break. This isn't one that I would believe would fetch uh, serious money that they, uh, a discussion would be warranted. All right. Uh, next up, we got a jersey and autograph for the L.A. Dodgers. Corey Seager, number 20 out of 30. Uh, Corey Seager is going to go to JB15385. For the Dodgers. And, of course, what's better than one Corey Seager auto, but a second Corey Seager auto. This time it's a gold frame patch auto, number 11 out of 30. That will also be going to JB15385. That was a heavy Dodger box right there. The two Corey Seagers plus the, um, plus the Jock Peterson helmet piece. All right, guys. Two boxes down, one to go. <laughs> that's pretty funny i will say this though we got the we got the best internet money can buy if the internet's going down it's not us it's everybody if we're going down and we're taking everybody down with us <laughs> now that's actually very rare something like that will happen for us So who knows? Maybe it's just yeah, still using American online CDs. <laughs> boo, 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 boo. <laughs> All right. Uh, first hit, number to 50. Got a game jersey patch for the Kansas City Royals. Eric Hosmer, 24 out of 50. Eric Hosmer, G-Shock 808, double dipping. Hey, James, how you doing, man? Um... Our website, firehandcards.com, has all of our open breaks available. I'll go ahead and punch that in for you right here. Actually, I'd rather do it this way for you. That way you can see all the breaks at once. I'll give you the link that I would use. Hey, James, I would say use that link. That way it shows you all the, all the items that we have available by availability. And uh, thanks for uh, thanks for jumping on for a little bit and watching our show. Hopefully, there's something you might be interested in getting into. All right, next up, number four out of five, Corey Seager. That's from the Father's Day jersey. That's a Father's Day jersey patch right there. JB fifteen three eighty five three times, man. You should be you, you you should be tried as a witch, man. Burn at the stake for hitting hitting Corey Seager three times in the same case. Either that or top, or either that or top should be uh, burned at the stake for allowing that to happen. <laughs> All right, next up we got an award winner's autograph for the Cincinnati Reds World Series champion, 1990 Barry Larkin, 33 of 35. Uh, Barry Larkin belongs to. I've been Ryan. Guess what? You've been Ryan this time. You pulled something there, Stephen. There you go. Very nice. All right, next up, we got a green bordered rookie autograph, 15 of 25, Rafe DeVers for the Boston Red Sox. Uh, Rafael DeVers belongs to Frank. Frank's got Rafael DeVers. All right, that one's 25. Next up. Our gold-framed autograph is numbered 1 out of 10 for the St. Louis Cardinals. Marky McGee, Mark McGuire. Uh, Mark McGuire belongs to DJ Cherney. There you go. Good stuff, man. All right, we're going to follow that up with a jersey autograph, green bordered version for the Philadelphia Phillies. 24 out of 25, J.P. Crawford. Uh, J.P. Crawford, Shoebot, double dipping with J.P. Crawford. All 
All right. Uh, next up, we got a game used bat and autograph, number 14 out of 40 for the Oakland Athletics, Jose Canseco. Jose Canseco belongs to J.P. Phila. Congratulations, J.P. All right. Uh, the last card of the break is a dual relic autograph, number 5 out of 35 for the Boston Red Sox. Chris Sale and Craig Kimbrell, 5 out of 35. Uh, Chris Sale, S. Murphy, 025. Craig Kimbrell is LTMB718. So we'll put this one to the random draw. All right, guys, and that concludes the opening of all three boxes. I'm going to do two randoms. Uh, we pulled three cards that uh, could go to random. However, uh, the first uh, uh, the first one that we pulled a dual autograph. This is a relic red. This is a red parallel, one of one. So these two, uh, I'm going to email the owners of these two players here to see what they want to do with this one. However, these two um, are kind of a lower tier as far as, far as uh, pricing goes. So we're going to put these ones to random. Raleigh Fingers and Dennis Eckersley, Chris Sale, and Craig Kimbrell. All right, so let's go ahead and get those randomizers set up. Put that over here. All right, we'll pull the we'll old randomize these in the order which they are pulled. So we'll do the fingers and Eckersley first. All right, guys, three times on draw. Name at the top is going to get the card. Good luck. One, two, and three. Going to the owner, Dennis Eckersley. Dennis Eckersley is owned by Bernie DeRoach. Bernie DeRoach is going to get the Dennis Eckersley and Raleigh Fingers dual auto. All right. And Chris Sale and Craig Kimbrell, number five out of 35. Do a draw for this one. All right, guys, three times on draw. Good luck. One. Two, three. Going to Craig Kimbrell. Craig Kimbrell is owned by LTMB718. All right, so we highlighted Dennis Eckersley right there. Craig Kimbrell is double dipped. He's right there. And once again, I'll email the owners of the players for this particular card and see what they want to do with it. It is a red parallel, so that's a one of one. All right, let me go ahead and set up a recap for you guys. I know we had a little bit of streaming issues here during uh, the feed. So, obviously, the uh, recap here is pretty paramount. Okay. Okay, here and here. All right, guys, here's our recap for 2018 Tops Definitive Random Players case number 10. Thank you for watching and joining. Here is what we pulled. Uh, number to 50, Eric Hosmer. Uh, autograph, Anthony Banda, Chan Sisko. Number to 40, Bat Autograph, Jose Canseco. The 35, Autographs, Reese Hoskins, Barry Larkin. Dual autograph, Raleigh Fingers and Dennis Eckersley. The random draw went to Dennis Eckersley. Uh, dual relic autograph, Chris Sale and Craig Kimbrell. The random draw went to Craig Kimbrell. Number to 30, Patch, Craig Kimbrell. And number to 30, Jersey autograph, Corey Seager. We also pulled a gold framed patch autograph, number 11 out of 30, Corey Seager. Also to 30, autograph, Andy Pettit. The 25, Josh Harrison. Also to 25, Robbie Alomar. Rafael Devers, green, uh, green Border Rookie Auto. Ahmed Rosario, Green Border Rookie Auto. And J.P. Crawford, Green Border Rookie Jersey Auto, the 25. All right, number to 15, Green Bordered Patch, Eric Hosmer. Purple Bordered Rookie Autograph to 10, J.P. Crawford. 
Purple Border Autograph Jersey, Miguel Sano to 10. Also to 10, Gold Framed Autograph, Mark McGuire. A Green Green Border Jersey Autograph, number 3 out of 10, Cal Ripken Jr. We pulled a Game Used Batting Helmet, Purple Border, number 5 out of 7, Jock Peterson. A Corey Seager, Purple Border uh, Patch, number 4 out of 5. And the 101 that we pulled was a Dual Autographed Relic Collection, Red Parallel Redemption, Anthony Rizzo and Kyle Schwarber. All right, guys, that's going to do it for the break. Thank you, everybody, for watching and joining. Congratulations on the lucky hitters. And until next one.